Okay, next up, uh, what's happening to affordable housing in and around NCR? Now, compared to Delhi's other affordable housing hubs like Rajnagar Extension, NH24 Bypass and Greater Faridabad, Noida Extension has been the more popular one for the budget home seeker simply because of its accessibility. But this property market has, from the very beginning, been sandwiched in the farmer authority builder deadlock. And this ain't going away in a hurry. Now, what's the latest now from this market? Are its legal troubles over? And what should you know before you invest in Noida Extension? Vasudhar Sharma reports. Acres and acres of agricultural land has given way to multiple residential developments here in Greater Noida West or Noida Extension. With 190 projects and over 1.5 lakh units in supply here, it won't be wrong to call this area a supermarket for flats. But is the budget home seeker assured of the best deal and a safe investment in this budding property hub? Vineet Verma represents one of the thousands who booked a flat in Noida Extension during the 2010-2012 boom phase when multiple projects launched here at a stunning price of just 1600 rupees per square foot. Today their investment may have appreciated but the home they had booked is nowhere close to what they had expected. Either the construction of their project is delayed or of poor quality. Jitni bhi families hain kareeban 2 lakh ke aas paas yahan par nivashak hain. वो सभी लोग परेशान हैं उन्हें किसी को अभी तक आशाना नहीं मिल पाया क्योंकि ये सब सरकार और बिल्डर्स के बीच का मामला था जिसमें के एक बायर फंस चुका है अलाहाबाद हाई कोर्ट्स लैंडमार्क ऑर्डर इन 2011 हैड ग्रांटेड एनहांस्ड कॉम्पेंसेशन टू फार्मर्स हुज लैंड वाज एक्वायर्ड फॉर दीस रेजिडेंशियल कॉम्प्लेक्सेस the Noida Authority has passed on this financial cost to builders now after the Supreme Court in February this month upheld the High Court decision. Builders are now charging their existing allottees an additional charge of 50 rupees per square foot, while the authority's other largest of granting extra FAR to builders to recover their losses has left buyers anxious. Either the layout of the flats are being changed or shrunk or extra floors are being built for which the number of lifts, parking and other amenities look insufficient. If there was a society of uh, say 5 uh, acre, uh, earlier there was around 600 flats, now there will be 800 flats. So 200 more family or you can say 25% more family. Uh, other infrastructure if you talk about swimming pool or gym or open area, that will be the same. So it will be a definitely a problem. However, for Noida Extension, the albatross around its neck has been the persistent litigation around land acquisition that keep investments here on shaky ground. After the Supreme Court this month ruled that no acquisition will be reversed, local landlords have given up their demand for the land on which the projects have come up. Instead, they are staking claim to their Abadi land, that is the land pocket on which their houses stand. मेरे हिसाब से अभी भी कोई किसान एग्रीकल्चर लैंड मांगने वापसी का हाई कोर्ट या सुप्रीम कोर्ट नहीं गया है सब अपने घर वापस ही मांग रहे हैं जिस जमीन में बिल्डरों के प्रोजेक्ट चल रहे हैं चल रहे हैं उस पे किसान कोई आपत्ति नहीं एक्विजिशन ये पुराना खारिज होना चाहिए फिर जो किसान की आबादी है उनको अधिग्रहण से मुक्त किया जाए डेवलपर्स आर हाउएवर अनपर्टर्ब्ड अबाउट दिस न्यू एंगल प्रॉब्लम कहां रही है अथॉरिटी के और फार्मर के बीच में कॉन्ट्रैक्ट्स आते कि वो लोग उन्होंने 20 20000 गज के कोई बाउंड्री करके और उसमें एक कोने में छोटा सा घर बना के बोलते हैं कि ये पूरी की पूरी मेरी आबादी है तो ऑथरिटीज को एक्सेप्ट नहीं करती है तो ये सबसे बड़ा एक थोड़ा सा कंफ्यूजन है उसको लेके लेकिन अब सुप्रीम कोर्ट में तो बिल्कुल क्लियर हो गया सुप्रीम कोर्ट ने बिल्कुल क्लियर बोला है कि जो जमीन जिसके पोजीशन में है वो जमीन का मालिक वही होगा उसका विद वेल कट वाइट रोड्स रनिंग वाटर इलेक्ट्रिसिटी एंड सीवरेज Noida extension is definitely a well planned area and the extension of the metro will further enhance its accessibility but this market should strictly be an end user's choice for investors neither is the stock selling today nor will his investment double in the coming days with camera person AJ Joseph Vasudha Sharma in the TV